Oh my god! Is she dead? Well, hi! Welcome back to the tenants, everybody. I just loaded up the game. We got a naked lady taking a shower and, uh, clearly a fire hazard over here. Wait, what? Oh, I'm sorry. I was introducing the video. She's all mad at me. No. All right. Well, I guess we still got items unlocked and a level up thanks to that. So, uh, yeah, that somehow worked out. Anyways, welcome back to the game where we become an abusive landlord. We're playing some more of the tenants. I gotta say, this is a, a very beautiful map. It looks like I can afford a trailer right now. I don't know if I want any more tenants right now. I have one and I feel like that's enough. So yeah, before we buy any more new apartments, let's start off with just, you know, a typical job here. I've got a couple of noisy tenants who are giving me a headache, looking for someone to help me take care of them. What are we doing? We beating them up? All right, cool. All right, I thought we were beating people up, but we're actually just taking care of the tenants. So that's fine. It looks like he's too busy in VR anyway. So I'll just let him do his thing. I do like the babysitting ones because I can do other jobs as I'm doing those jobs. Looks like Webster Street needs to find a perfect tenant. I haven't done any of those before. Let's try that out. All right, looks like these two are not liking it too much. How about you? Everyone's like, what the hell is this place? I gotta say, it doesn't look too bad. I mean, the color coordination could be better. Term of the lease, 60. Let's, let's see if we can get 3K here. Oh, that actually wasn't too bad. I'm gonna lower mine a little bit because we learned from our mistakes last time. Make that offer. Come on, come a little closer. There we go, accept current offer. I don't even know if that's good or not, but again... That's a weird ass quest, by the way. Hey, I'm gonna hire some guy to get a tenant for me and I have no idea who this guy is. All right, so we got a rat issue. Of course, we're gonna send our uncle over there. I ain't gonna do anything with that. Oh my God, there's a lot of rats. Okay, there we go. Is that the final one? Yes, take the cheese. Hey, wait, 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 wait. What did I, what? <laughs> what is going on back here? Wait, what? <laughs> I did not, I almost didn't even notice that. Seems like we got some shady individuals here. <laughs> Uncle, it's time to cook. Don't leave. What the hell? What the? Oh my God, there's an earthquake. You gotta help me during the recent earthquake. A few walls got damaged. Holy Jesus. That's actually amazing. Oh my God, there's so much going on though. Okay, yeah, we, we, we have problems here. I just realized there's a moonshine business here too. The more I look at this place, the better it gets. Well, bad news. It looks like the earthquake affected my residence as well. Uh, so yeah, I guess I got to get on repairing that. Looks like my tenant's lease is ending soon. I suggest try to renegotiate the terms for another few months, but hey, it's up to you. Uh, oh my God, there is so much going on. I regret taking this babysitting job. I was working on the earthquake, but then we had an another rat issue. Um, oh God, is she doing it? Oh God, oh, what the hell is going on? There's so much, ah! All right, let's negotiate the lease. I think she hired this guy for me, thanks. Again, just avoid your problems and they're solved, guys. All right, I'm gonna do a max of 2,000 here. She is not liking me. You know what? Let's, I feel like we should terminate her anyways and then maybe work on this place a little bit. Let's do it. Screw you. All right, so I can't renovate this place until she's gone. So we have to do some more babysitting jobs. So I guess we can do that right now. All right, seems like Cindy's happy to leave. So I'm happy to see her gone. Let's begin renovations. I'm on a babysitting job right now, but not much is going on, so... One thing we really need in here is a shower. All right, so we're gonna get the creme de la creme of showers here. You're gonna have to squeeze into this room, but at least you're gonna have a nice shower experience. There, we'll have a $2,500 TV in the world's smallest apartment. Also added a coat hanger, and you know what? Every good apartment needs a plant. Ah, there we go, a twig with Christmas lights on it. That's seriously what it is, isn't it? Isn't it beautiful? Actually, you know what? We don't have a dining room table. Let's throw one of those here so we actually have a place to eat. All right, we added a toaster and that is a much nicer looking apartment. It at least has everything it needs in the bare minimum at that. All right, so let's begin open house and hopefully this time we can negotiate a little bit better. Um, I'm only gonna do leaflets. This, this, this apartment isn't worth $350. Oh, we got a lot of interest here. Oh, no. Okay, he does not like the world map. Come on. Just, do you guys like anything? All right, more confusion. Happiness! Okay, I, that's the first time I've seen a happy face. I might need to negotiate with her. You know what? I'm going to spend some money on a, on a background check. We're waiting for review. How long does this take? No criminal history, no criminal record, and zero debt. I just realized the personality type's alcoholic. But right. goddamn, making 80K as a fast food worker? 
You 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 have enough money to be an alcoholic. Let's ne negotiate. All right, my alcoholic friend. How about three thousand dollars? I'm not gonna go too crazy. Oh, see that that's good. That's that's way better than before. I'm gonna drop it down a little bit so she'll go up a little bit hopefully. Ah, uh, I'm gonna keep my offer. Let's see what happens here. Come on. No, please. Can we go back to where we were? Okay, she. You know what? She pretty much stayed. I'm gonna accept. That wasn't awful. I am really bad at the negotiation. Uh oh, what the hell happened? I got a situation here with a leaky pipe. Um, I guess we'll send a pro in. Oh my God, is she drinking already? Holy crap, she really is an alcoholic. She's chugging them. Yeah, take one back. You're at home. You don't gotta go anywhere. She's not even hitting her mouth with that one. Gosh, she's gonna fall through the wall. <laughs> she's wasted. Dude, this game's amazing. All right, having an alcoholic as a tenant might not be the best idea, but as long as she doesn't break anything, I mean, she can dance around and flop around all she wants. Just give me my damn money. Oh my God, is she dead? <laughs> I left for a second, what happened? I don't know if she's passed out or dead. Should I call the cops? Lisa, okay, I have some rats to deal with, Lisa. I'm sorry. Why am I sorry? You're the one that did it. Um. Okay, oh, man, see, I want to send a pro in because I hate doing this, but $1,600 is a lot of money. So, uncle, get in there. So, what's pretty cool about this game is properties actually go up for sale and get... Oh, God, not again. I was just... Come on, let me talk. Anyways, properties go up for sale and then they do get sold. So, you, you really have to be ready to buy these things at the right time because right now all I have is these extremely expensive ones. Uh, so I'm not gonna get any new tenants anytime soon. Anyways, let's go see the damage to my freaking place. Oh, great. She's dancing with the repair guy now. Leave the repair guy alone. Go go to bed, you drunk. Oh, God. Oh, she's puking now. She's puking. This lady, you, you really need to change your lifestyle. Jesus, drinking alone in your little apartment. Giving your own self a damn swirly. Is this gonna be a nightly thing with us? Well, at least tonight she didn't pass out on the floor. She seems to be doing better. Maybe she's turning her life around after all. Well, I just asked Lisa for her money and she gave it to me right away. So she might be an alcoholic, but at least she's reliable for her payments. Lisa, I didn't even have to ask this time. She sent it to me right away. Oh my God, you're such a responsible alcoholic. Oh, dude, I, I was just praising you. Now you're short of cash. You know what? <laughs> you're enough entertainment to keep around. Let's just, let's just let, let it slide for today. Okay, and there we go. We got a bunch of new unlocks, mostly uh, good posters. We got an amazing offer in the bank. We're finally eligible for a loan. Pull out your phone, boot it up the bank app. It's gonna allow us to finally start building this empire. Well, that's exciting. But before that, oh, that's right. I can't, I can't renovate until she's gone. I was gonna put up some posters for her. Oh, she's drunk before she gets off. Of her. I want, I want the bigger loans. Uh, I guess I can only take this one. Are the interest rates all the same? Oh, they are. Okay, well, it doesn't make sense to get the quick loan then. I'd rather pay it slowly. All right, there we go. We actually got some money in the bag. Now we got 85 grand. I don't think I can buy any of the places though. Oh, this one just came up. How much is this? 93, we're close. All right, we might need to do a couple jobs and hopefully that's still on the market by the time I'm done them. Cause yeah, that's all I'm seeing in the slums right now. All right, everybody was mad at me cause I wasn't taking the um, renovation seriously last time. So I'm gonna actually try and build good ones now. So we need some tile down here. We're building a bathroom, by the way. Let's go for a dark style here. I'm going to get this nice bathtub here. This looks actually really nice. I'm going to move this over to this wall because I think I should have enough room to put this over here. It just makes more sense to put it on this wall, I think. We're going to get the fancy toilet brush. Always want a fancy toilet brush. All right, I got everything done, but I need like some inspirational quotes here or something. Actually, you know what? Oh, dude, I'm, I, I'm, I'm brilliant. Everybody loves a good game of poop darts. And then I'm just going to put be brave above the toilet just to really confuse people. I, I love how I said I was going to take this seriously. Oh, crap. I just realized we need a wall clock or a wall plant. But yeah, I, I just can't take these things seriously. Um, yeah, We'll put the time right by the dartboard. Only other thing I really need in here is a mirror. So yeah, we'll put it like that and bam, done. I spend way too much time on this. Lisa, you're leaving? No, I enjoyed, I enjoyed our relationship. You got drunk and paid me and uh, I had a somewhat happy tenant. Anyways, I'm building another beautiful bedroom right now. They want an anime once again. What I really love is their preferred furniture is a microwave and a fan. This person knows how to party. All right, we're gonna get you the creme de la creme of microwaves for your bedroom. I also had the fan on the ground. 
because you know that's where they want it and there you go what more could you ask for oh a game dude i thought this whole game thing i keep having an issue with it all right so i put the other game on the on the floor and it seemed like that one was good enough all right and there we go we got 93k you know what that means i think we got enough money to buy this thing oh god oh god oh god not again what is up with the wh where we live? Well, we might not have any money anymore because I think I damaged my unit. Damn it, I gotta have to pay bills too. Oh, okay, we're gonna need one more job. Yeah, I had to, I have to pay my bills. I must be responsible. And actually, it looks like I lucked out during that earthquake. I guess Drunko wasn't here to bang the walls or something like that because I didn't get affected at all. So let's do another open house so we get paid right away. All right, we got two apartment score fines and actually they're all fine. So it's not good, but it's not bad. Who, who makes the most money? Ah, the athlete nursing aid here. Yeah, you know what? Let's um, let's ne negotiate with them. All right, let's, let's start high at 4,000. Come on, please. Come on, just, you have lots of money. Dude, that's so much better than usual. I love the negotiations. All right, I, I have to be a little lenient here because it screws up if we don't. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna accept that. You know what? It's close enough to what, what I asked for. And also, good good news, that babysitting job got me enough money to purchase this place. And would you look at that? We're moving up in the world. We can do brown kitchens now. I don't like any of this. We're just going to sell it all. I hope I have enough money to at least renovate this place. I just, I can't have this. This is ugly. All right, so I took down one of these walls. It was just, this is too small of an apartment to have walls. So we're just going to have a bathroom and then have everything else in one room. I think it will look good. Trust me. So I needed some more money for my renovation. So, um, yeah, I got a rich guy once again on a boat. Surprise, surprise again. Good thing is... Oh, damn it, I failed that one. But if I can repair this stuff, I can actually put it in my inventory and use it later. There we go. So I can either sell it or salvage it. Oh, dude, this is fantastic. This is just added money. All right, there we go. Another rich guy who wants to play a uh, sailor. So, oh, decor is only 94. Oh, well, too late. Is this the same guy? I mean, he did have a parrot before, too. He didn't like the bell? What, what, what about your treasure map? Why are you confused? You literally asked for the treasure map. Don't, don't, don't even blame me on that one. I got the re renovated flat as expected, and I am a realist. No major complaints. Okay, well, don't really care if you're complaining or not. I just needed the money. Now we got money, so that's good. I'm going to pay off my debts. And let's finish up Fairy Street. So I have been working on it. I mean, it's a tight space, but it's working out. Oh, God damn it, man. It's never a dull moment. Send a pro in. I'm too busy. I'm building a damn unit here. But yeah, I actually did want to build this well. It's going well. A little tight for space, but overall, it's working, as you can see. I really wanted to focus on the kitchen, and I'm pretty happy with the layout of it. So yeah, we got uh, this living room, bedroom area over here. I'm going to add a little bit more to that. Obviously, I haven't done anything with the bathroom yet, so we're going to do that now. Oh my god, I think I can actually maybe fit this in here. This is a massive sink. I think it would look really nice. And then maybe if we put a toilet over there. Again, going with the fancy ones. I don't need a sink anymore because it's connected to that. So we'll just add a plunger. I feel like if you don't add a plunger, <laughs> there might actually be leaks. I haven't had that happen yet, but I wouldn't uh, be surprised if it did. Um, okay, yeah, 629 for this. Again, tight fit. But hey, wh wh what do you expect when you're in a small apartment building? And I gotta say, that that is a bathroom for a small king. A very small king. Just gonna add this mirror here because it's the only mirror I have that really works. Uh, looks like I just got paid, so great. And uh, there we go. That's... I mean, that's everything I need. So I'll just add some finishing touches now and put this on the market. We have Mario holding a pitchfork. So yeah, of course we're going to put that down there. You know what? Actually, this is some pointless space, but I think I know what to do with it. Washing machine. Everybody loves it when they own their own washing machine. Is there dryers in this too? Or is it just washing machines? Nah, just hang them out the window. You're good, I guess. I had a speaker system here because why not? Um, coat rack. Did I add one of those yet? I don't really have enough room for one that sits on the ground, but I definitely want one. So we'll add the wall hanger over here. It's gonna add a laptop here just to live at large. Oh, only thing I really don't have is a dresser. But we don't need that crap. Get some trippy ass art over here. Hell yeah, dude. I'm actually unlocking a bunch of art, so maybe I should add some more here. Again, a world map. We always need a... Actually, should I just move this? Not really any good place to put it, unfortunately. I'm running out of space here, so... I feel like that was honestly the best area. No, actually, right there. So we have some room on this wall for something. All right, I added a clock and a calendar. I feel like that's a responsible thing to do. So, yeah. I gotta say, for my second little apartment, that's not bad. And yeah, let's let's get our first tenant. Open house time. I'm, I'm pretty happy about this. 
Let's start a newspaper ad. Get some really good tenants in here. Hopefully another responsible alcoholic. All right, we have one that's considered exceptional. This one's considered fine. This one's considered good. Exceptional, don't leave yet. Um, a cook, 48 years old. I'm gonna do a background check. I, I do not trust a cook. A co co cooks are always shady. No, no criminal record. Okay, ten ten Tennessee history check. I'm spending the money just to make sure. Opinion was fine. Okay, we are definitely gonna negotiate. Someone who's actually responsible, I want 60 days as well. Let's start at something high because you really want this place. 4,600, damn it. Oh my God, she really wants this place. And sorry, that's profit. That's plus the $1,110. Um, I don't even want to really negotiate here, but I'm going to try it a bit because I'm cheap. Let's try 5440, and there we go. I mean, she's got to win with a, a couple bucks, <laughs> but I'm the true winner here, God damn it! That, that went really well. I'm going to make a lot of money under this unit. So surprise, surprise, it actually makes sense to build a unit that's nice. Um, and yeah, on that, guys, I think we'll wrap up this episode here. We got our first real unit. I mean, that's not to say boring lane isn't a real unit. It just, it just was given to me, so it doesn't feel the same but yeah i hope you guys are enjoying this game once again this is the tenants and uh yeah we'll be doing some more in the near future hopefully you know building an actual tenant empire because i gotta say i'm really enjoying this game the actual people in the game feel really unique and they're very fun to watch and experience so yeah as always guys thanks for watching and liking and i'll see you in the next one